Hey loves, it's Wednesday again. It's actually not that early today though. It's gonna be 9.30, so I am gonna be doing Pilates today, but I'm only gonna be doing one class today instead of two. And I have a few things I wanted to show you today. It is also the last Wednesday before I'm finally out of my job and I'm gonna show you guys so much more content than what I've been showing you guys recently. But I am really excited just because of several reasons. Number one is, I got a new mirror. Isn't it so nice? I love it. So nice. Top tier for content, if you ask me. I'm coming out with a new at-home Pilates Princess program um, that will be accessible probably around December. I still have to do all the videos of the workouts and all that. I'm just trying to perfect them for you guys. It's going to be definitely the toughest program that I've created so far, um, but not on you guys, just on me, um, because this is one-on-one -on -one classes sort of thing. They're pre-recorded videos, but they're going to be full-on classes that you can watch me and do. It's minimal equipment, super affordable, and I'm really excited to show you guys that, but mainly today is going to be based on a what I eat in a day and what I do in a day for my gains and just more vlogging if that makes sense. I also wanted to mention that I now work with EHP. I'm so happy about it. I got my collagen. I got some protein. I got more protein. All vegan because you know I cannot have dairy. Um, and even some more protein. Cute shaker bottle, of course. They like that's essential when you're working with a new company. And I got my favorite, two Oxy Shred. This is going to save me a lot of money because your girl has been spending a lot of money on other energy drinks and things like that and I just can't be doing it anymore. So this is gonna be my go-to for a pretty long time for the foreseeable future. If you don't know what Oxy Shred is, it says it's a thermogenic fat burner kind of thing. I honestly just feel like it has a really good amount of caffeine in it and I do feel like it does tend to decrease your appetite a little bit which does help when being in a calorie deficit and if you know me i am in a calorie deficit my main goal is fat loss at the moment so if you know what that means that means you have to be in a calorie deficit which means you have to eat less which means it's kind of tough to eat less sometimes and it's a lot of discipline so this definitely comes hand in hand when it comes to suppressing your appetite a little bit and also giving you that boost in caffeine so i'm definitely going to be taking this right now also, if you're interested in buying anything from EHP, please use my code SAVON. You get discounts and it also helps support me. Also, while I'm opening this, I wanted to mention that before Pilates, which is in literally two, uh, like an hour and a half, I'm gonna go to the gym first and I'm gonna make some content. Um, like I mentioned, I'm making an at-home Pilates program. So I'm gonna do little, like little snippets of it for like workouts wise that I'm gonna post on my socials if you wanna go do like a little Pilates workout. I'm For what I eat today, I'm kind of planning on taking some inspo from, I know it says Victoria's Secret Meal Inspo, but the actual videos look really good. Like, look how good this looks. Okay, so they have like oatmeal, they have chicken veggies, but sweet potato, chicken salad, yogurt bowls, like some like sort of goat cheese, tomato toast. But like the first two slides look really, really good. So I'm definitely gonna take some inspo from this. I don't necessarily eat oatmeal like that. I feel like I never end up having good oatmeal, but we do have blueberries, we do have almonds and we do have plant protein now. You must think that I'm a restless case because I ran away, because I ran away. If you listen to the words I say, you know that I'm okay. You know it's just a phase. Don't think I'm leaving because I'm not at all. And if you get hurt, it's unintentional. I just want to do to realize that I'm the one.
Pilates, so I'm gonna be making some protein oatmeal. I'm filming this on my phone at the same time, but I just saw this video of someone who said their protein oats tasted good, so I'm gonna do it the exact way that she did it. because your girl has tried protein oats so many times and never comes out right, but I think I made this one better than the other time, so. I've cracked the code. This is the best vegan protein I've ever tasted. If you are vegan or if you're lactose intolerant and it's so tough to find a good plant-based protein, try this. And use my code Savon to get discounts and support me. I always take my supplements after I eat just because sometimes they make me nauseous. I feel like when I do take my vitamins, I definitely feel a difference in my body, especially when it comes to my appetite and energy. So take your vitamins, girls. All right, so I showered, I brushed my hair, and all I have left content-wise is to do one of me using these makeup brushes that you can buy on TikTok shop. And wearing styling this jumpsuit so the last two videos that i just created were this one making protein oats in this one the one that i showed you guys i did um you can check that out on my tiktok and then i worked on an at home pilates ab workout you can do no equipment needed i'm actually really um proud of this one but i'm only posting this on tiktok because i'm super picky on what i post on instagram As you can see I got some matcha um, my boyfriend actually ordered the pink package bulldog ramen if you know what that is it's the best ramen out there I don't care the best package ramen okay um, but there's no ingredients at his house so we're gonna go to Publix we're gonna get some eggs some green onion and we're gonna make some ramen because it's so good I know this is not really the best in your diet but if you're in a calorie deficit you can definitely modify eat things in moderation and still get to your goals start recording but I'm finally home I'm so tired um, and a little bit hungry you might be wondering with the whole intermittent fasting thing that I do how come I'm eating at like 8 30 or 9 p.m. Um, at this point I'm not really being focused on intermittent fasting anymore I just tend to get hungry around 12 now after 12 I kind of just 
eat from my hunger cues. So every four to five hours, I'll get hungry, make a meal. Usually if I have to eat late, then I'll eat something that's light. Um, for example, today, since I had oats and ramen, that's a lot of carbs in there. So we're gonna not put any carbs really in this meal that I'm gonna have now. I'll probably just have protein with veggies. So maybe a salad kind of thing. We'll see now. We're working with leftovers. So we have some leftover meat. We have goat cheese, some spinach, baby tomatoes, cucumber, and mushrooms. So what I plan to do is cook these mushrooms, saute them, um, have that as a side, and then have a mini salad, um, probably with a little dressing or olive oil or something like that, and the meat. That's my meal. Just a little bit of salt. I don't want anything crazy. And some pepper. Grabbing just a small handful of spinach, the cucumbers, and some baby tomatoes. We're gonna eat up this meat. I'm gonna use the light Italian dressing from Olive Garden. We're going to cut some of this meat up. We put our mushrooms. You don't always have to be creative. Just use what you have at home. I'm sure if you've done at least a little bit of groceries, you have something. Make sure to buy like essential such as your proteins, veggies, um, and really that's about it. concludes today's video. I hope you really liked this video. Just a quick reminder that every day is different. Today I didn't have a sweet tooth. Um, tomorrow I might. Yesterday I had a sweet tooth. Like it really just depends but all in all it's based on balance. I hope this enlightened you in some way or inspired you or helped you get to your goals the way I get to my goals. But other than that, let me know down below what kinds of videos you like and I'll see you once I'm done fully with work.